Hello there, my name is Rachel Lucky Talk About Animation, and today we're going to talk about the Six Dawns of Villainous. If you don't know what I'm talking about, in the spin off series of Villainous called High Risk or Risky Reward or whatever name I decided to change it again, but besides that, there are a total of six Dawns. Each Dawn actually wants something about Missy, but we don't know what because the miniseries is still going on. But it's so interesting is the fact how fan the fandom is sort of kind of predicting sort of things maybe happen or who is the next Don. This is a few theories they actually come up with that is sort of kind of interesting. Of course, before we get started, we need to describe at least the first three Dons that is confirmed to be Dons. The first one will be Porcini, who is sort of says to have the nightclubs will be sort of underground to make sure he doesn't get attention to the cops. Of course, it'll be interesting. This Don, he actually is a deal maker from Black. Cat. We don't know he is inside the organization. It's just sort of a person who like make deals. He's sort of interesting because he you don't really know what he want for Miss Seat. But according to Blackham, he's always second best to King Casino, the second Don who is probably higher higher than Porcini. But it makes sense and the more you keep thinking about it that maybe he wants Miss Seat to bump off King Casino so he could be number one or the other theory come up with that he doesn't favor for miss doom who is another don who wants missy bumped off that could be the two theories connected to a porcini that could be very interesting or even that he just want doesn't just, just want to take down k casino but also a rest of five dons next to him so he could be the only one who is top Dog. That could be a possibility that is, is very interesting. This is the reason why he wants this seat. But at the same time, that could be very risky if he does decide to use Miss Seat to take down one or all Dons because he easily created a mob war in the underground universe of Venomous. What's more, that's just a theory or at least a possibility for a storyline. Now let's talk about the second that will be King Casino. King Casino ha probably doesn't really care about Miss Seed, but honestly he's sort of interesting. We don't know his sort of motivation becoming a Don, but we do know he's a compulsion of a gambler who likes gambling in the gambling universe. And that's pretty much it for now because the mini series is still running, but yet he's a fascinating character. He is sort of a parody of that sort of kind of manga type of character who gambles, something like you you go now words. But for right now he's still very interesting. Hoping you could get more information about him. Now a third Don that is confirmed in this series it will be Miss Doom. Miss Doom is a sort of fashion model who is an alien who is very powerful, can take over the universe or specifically Earth if she chooses. But at the end she liked being praised and kissed her own feet because of her beauty, she became a model. But no one knew she was a dumb till this comic revealed that. That was sort of kind of interesting. Of course, being one of the, uh, one of the six dons, it makes sense that she want, or at least in theory, she wants to actually have Miss Seed to control her because the insult she gave to her, she being taken down by Miss Seed, even that she doesn't know who she was. And that is sort of a good motivation why she wants Miss Seed, or maybe she doesn't even care anymore, she's trying to run her own empire. But that could be a very interesting kind of plot line if she, if Alan and his team decide to continue tell, telling that story. Now let's talk about the rest three Dons that nobody, nobody really sure that actually are Dons. The fourth Don will probably be the Evil Queen. We don't know much about who this person is because she just sort of was name dropped. The only one who knows or what she is is Blanchelm that she's talked about. She's the one who got hired by Deepa Queen. But all of that, we have just speculation, not really much to go from. But once more, that's sort of interesting. Of course, the f fifth Don is basically a fan theory, had to be a dark factor. If you don't know who Dark Fandom, you probably know his son, Dark Factor Jr. That he's sort of a lazy bum who very cocky, who has no talent. He constantly gets in trouble in the villain world because he doesn't know how to be good at anything. Only his right hand man, Gale, who keeps saving his ass. In fact, 
this character gets so much in trouble, the reason why he still lives is because of the father, who is a member inside the organization Black Hat. Even that, he's a high high ranking member. Do you know why his high ranking member is because it's his own hat? His hat depends on what kind of ranking he is. And his father pretty high, but we don't know who he is or what he looks like. Supposedly he looks like Dark Factor Jr. or at served similarly to him. But because of that hat, he also inside an organization, Dark Friday Jr. is safe for now. But all that, that's sort of interesting because we don't know, is, is he uh, the member? He, is he a Don? He make, well, basically explain so many things about Dark Friday Jr., why he cannot be touched. But at the same time, he could easily be the 1% or in fact, he just is a member of the organization. He's nothing really to do with the Don family. That could be very good, bad up to you, who knows, you want to see Doc Phantom Sr. to be a mob boss or not, or you just don't care, you feel it could be a different new character for that slot. Now the 6th Don, honestly, nobody knows who the 6th Don could be, anyone could be a brand new character, but yet it's just sort of interesting to sort of talk about it. Of course, there's all that one more question, is what the reason they want seats once again we just don't know just theories throwing on the wall because we just who knows in fact i think one of the most interesting theories is main Puccini wants miss seat is because he's a fan of miss seat he is the original simp we honestly don't know that could be a possibility i mean we know miss Vin doom who probably will kill her because of what she did to her or the other dons maybe they didn't want her maybe they're not but it's sort of an interesting storyline with Duo Miss Seed. He also explains how Miss Seed escaped from prison because her account of her Instagram account was activated, saying, Do you miss me? Even that phrase, Do you miss me, could actually mean something else entirely of this mini series if one of the time Miss Seed reappears. And of course, anything like that, I will put it up this video for a second video called. Maybe the sixth down uh, volume two or a completely different name. Just continue this sort of conversation if it comes up in interesting. Or if not, this is probably the only video I probably make. Other than that, what do you think about all the Dons? Do you think uh, Dark Family Jr. actually is a Don or his father is? Or you, you think uh, Evil Queen is not a Don? Or it could be an alias from Miss Van Doom because she doesn't want to ruin her good name or spoil it what's gonna happen next because a lot of people speculating evil queen is a code name not a real name or a new character it's just miss doom just sort of disguised her name just to make sure get what she wants or not maybe kind of start a fight or war of the other dance that could be a possibility also we just don't know. Could be a lot of things. In fact, what is your theory of all six dots? Do, do can you guess who's the six? Or you just don't care. You just have hopefully it'll be a new type of character. Tell me down below. Let me know. This was a separate conversation of the villainous universe, specifically of the six dots. I got nothing else to say. Just thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and have a wonderful day. Bye.